We want to start with that breaking news of that full freeway closure after a serious crash involving a semi and a car on I-43 at Highway 60. This is happening in Ozaki County this morning in the Grafton area, and that's where Adriana Mendez joins us live with more on the crash there and our traffic situation this morning. Adriana, good morning. Yeah, good morning, morning, Susan and Tom. As you mentioned, the interstate I-43, the southbound lanes currently closed due to a crash involving a semi and a vehicle right behind me, right here, just before Highway 60. You can see a sheriff deputy vehicle kind of easing traffic off of the interstate, blocking off the interstate lanes, forcing traffic to get off the interstate right at Highway 60. Now, when our photojournalists arrived a little bit after 2.30, you could see a, that scene there involving that semi and a vehicle that had significant damage to it. There are also firefighter trucks there as well as squad cars on scene. Now we are working to learn more information on what exactly led up to this crash or if there are any injuries and the extent of those injuries. But as of right now, if you are traveling southbound on an I-43, you're going to want to add on some additional time because that interstate currently closed on the southbound side. The northbound lanes are still open this morning. The rest of the roadways across the interstate system look pretty good. There are no other issues for your morning commute besides I 43 here, so we're going to continue to stay out here all morning and try to gather some more information on exactly what led up to this crash back to the studio.